Hey, what's up everybody? Uh, got another awesome Shelby here. This is a 67 GT500 factory Acapulco blue four speed. Um, it's a really good car, really great color. Cars last on the road in 74. It's got the original Kelsey Hayes mag stars all the way around. <clears throat> the car's never been restored. It's a really great example of a just a kind of a survivor 67 500 and what I mean by kind of a survivor is just that you know it's never been fully restored basically yeah it's had some paint work I could tell here and there but it's a great car outboard lights <clears throat> original hood trunk lid all that good stuff let me pop the hood here Okay, <clears throat> so the car has the original heads, original intake, original two fours, uh, both carburetors are original, date coded. It's got the original radiator, original Shelby tag, the Shelby stamp is on the passenger side shock tower. I've got the hood hinges unhooked just because uh, it was stressing the hood a little bit and it was wanting to bow it. Original distributor, um, I guess the short block is actually a 427 side oiler. So that's been upgraded, most people would say. In my opinion, it's a nice upgrade, but it is a 427 side oiler. Short block with the original uh, C7 AEA heads and the original 2.4 intake and like I said original distributor, original carburetors, original radiator. It's got the original four speed top loader. It's a rug S1 with the VIN stamp on it. It's got the original 31 spline 9 inch rear spec case. Now the front seats have been changed. Somebody put 69 Mach 1 buckets in it. <clears throat> now I do have all of the deluxe trim for a pair of 67 buckets. I've got the hardback shells, the side pieces, all the hardware. The car does still have its original Shelby steering wheel, original 8K redline tack, Stuart Warner gauges, original radio. radio. <clears throat> Headliner's in good shape. Original roll bar, seat belts. Still got the Cobra seat belts in it, front and rear. Fold down deluxe seat. The interior's actually really clean. Pop the trunk. <clears throat> So the uh, jack instructions, I guess, lived on the floor of this one, but as you can see, floor pan's really nice. Trap door's never been cut for speakers. Really nice floor pans. The, you know, the paint is showing wear. Um, a little faded on the fiberglass trunk lid it's been on there since the 70s so that's kind of what you would expect <clears throat> but yeah it's just a great uh real deal 67 gt500 four speed factory acapulco blue it's a beautiful car if i chose to keep it i probably wouldn't do a thing to it just drive it the way it is because <clears throat> it looks great But it's basically, uh, you know, 
it's it's very original like i said really the the short block has been upgraded to a 427 side oiler i've got pictures of the cross bolt mains and the side oiling galleys uh it's a 69 side oiler but original top end still got the uh the original top loader the VIN stamps on the bottom but uh and we'll take a bunch of pictures of it and get a little driving video for you. Thanks. Bye.